are planning to take your dog for a walk in the morning. It's going to be a little bit chilly out there. 52 degrees by 7 a.m. 53 by 8 a.m. We're going to just stay in the 50s throughout most of the morning. We are tracking some cloudy skies as well. So keep that in mind. Let's talk about the temperatures right now. Here's the princess in Scottsdale. They got the lights up, of course. 59 degrees there. Let's go up to the high country where we can see Flagstaff's at 27. Tuba City, you're at 29, page 39. And Prescott over sitting over at 41 degrees and Payson at 39. And here's a look at what we're tracking for the start of the work week. It's going to be cloudy across the board for everyone. But I want you all to take note of how the temperatures are beginning to slowly drop. We've been above average across the board for everyone in Arizona because of this high pressure, but it should leave the state by Tuesday. And you can see Prescott going from the mid 60s to the upper 50s by Wednesday. And after that, temperatures will also continue to drop across the board. So we're not over there. We're not through the woods just yet. They're going to continue to drop by Friday. Cottonwood going from the upper 60s to the mid 60s by Wednesday. Pine Top. You're going to go to the low 50s by Wednesday and same for Heber as well. Now we are tracking some rain this upcoming week with that system that's going to make temperatures just a little bit cooler out there and we're tracking a significant amount for not just the valley, but pretty much all of Arizona definitely needs some of that rain because it's been a while since we've seen some of it. Just throwing up the drought monitor to show y'all our situation where we're at still tracking that extreme drought in the southeast of Valley. Though Yuma doing a good job of avoiding the drought situation. Here's a look at what we're tracking this upcoming week. Those cloudy skies are going to stick around. It's going to be another warm afternoon in the upper 70s, but our temperatures also begin to drop. We're going to be in the mid 70s by Tuesday, low 70s by Wednesday and the start of winter. Our best chance to see some rain will be Friday and Saturday as we drop back into the 60s back where we should be for this time of the year. And those lows also staying nice and cool in the 50s. Next Sunday, Christmas Eve, looking sunny, looking pretty nice if you have any outdoor plans. And that's a look at your first alert forecast.